The way it works is very simple and straightforward. Usually a drone is reported in an area where it should be. This can be reported by a human, it can be reported by an, a ground radar system or an RF system that's detecting a drone in a no-fly zone. That system will autonomously cue or send a message to our drone hunter. So the law enforcement official will either take the, the drone hunter out of their car or the, the drone hunter will be deployed at this, at this site because it's, it's there to protect the critical infrastructure. Uh, the drone hunter will receive an automated cue and autonomously with no pilot, no joystick, will launch into the air and go to the sector where the target drone uh, was found. Sometimes up to a mile or two away from the, um, the area that's being protected or outside the perimeter of the no-fly zone. The drone hunter will then autonomously with the onboard radar um, detect the target drone and will track it and will um, safely shoot it down with a net and tow it away to a safe location either capturing it with a drape net or capturing it with a, a, a target net. So a drone hunter is used by anybody that wants to protect a no-fly zone. So whether that no-fly zone is over a border, around a data center, around a stadium, an outdoor venue, anywhere you have airspace that could be threatened by a drone, a drone bringing um, a bomb or invading privacy or doing any kind of illegal surveillance, those are the customers that would want a drone hunter to patrol their airspace and keep their airspace safe.